So you want to make sure that you're in the algebra view. So looking at this, you're now in algebra view. You can go in and type in the function y equals 1 over x. Make sure you use the division sign, and as you can see, it'll give you the graph. Look up to the function window, and it has 1 over x, which is 1 divided by x. You can zoom in and out using the two-finger sweep and make it bigger or larger. Let's take a look at 1 over x plus 1. Make sure you put parentheses in the denominator there to keep that group together. As you can see, look up at your function window again to check and see that it looks like the function you want. If you highlight it, it'll bold face, I guess, is a good term for it, the graph that you're on top of. Take a look at what happens when you don't put it in the group. If you have just y equals 1 over x plus 1, look at how that's different. It has the 1 outside of the fraction, and so it's just 1 over x plus 1. It's a different shift, totally different graph, and you'll take a look at a whole bunch of these when you're, hopefully, you'll take a whole bunch of these. Um, Again, take a look at what happens when you do both shifts and the change that happens there. Here we have y equals 1 over x plus 1 plus 1. So both shifts are happening in this one. Have fun exploring.